In this problem, we have to simplify the square root of negative 289. So the first step in a problem like this is to deal with this negative that you see in the square root here. So whenever you have a negative in the root like this, it automatically becomes an i. And then we still have the square root of 289. Now the square root of 289 is 17. This is equal to i times and then 17. But nobody really leaves the i in the front like this. So they usually put it in the back. So this is 17 i. And so that would be the answer. However, a better way to do this is as follows. So whenever you see a negative like this in the square root, you say, okay, there's gonna be an i. And then you say the square root of 289 is 17. So this is 17 i. And that's the answer. Again, you basically look at the negative in the square root and it automatically tells you there's gonna be an i. The square root of 289 is 17, so you just make that leap. This is much quicker and much faster than the first method we did it because it takes less work and in more complex problems, it will be far superior. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.